Welcome to TechTed.com. This is nice interface of your favorite website, TechTed. And today in this short video, I'll be showing you the database system behind this TechTed.com. Okay, so uh, let's have an overview of database management system and uh, how it actually looks like. Okay, so first of all, I'll show you how it looks through terminal. So. I have localhost and uh, MySQL server installed on my local system on my computer and I can log into the database system using this command MySQL hyphen U which uh, prompts for user and username this is username and then this password so it will prompt for password now it is asking password so I'll enter my password okay so now I'm logged into MySQL server now to show how many databases are there in the server I have to enter show databases these are the list of databases over this server so this is detected dev which is the database I'll be showing you but before that I want to uh, consider this I want to observe this thing this information schema is a database so this information schema is basically the database which stores the data of this database system itself what I want to say uh, say here is we have a database system so we have some information regarding this database system itself like what are the users which can log into this database system what are the privileges for each user okay so all these things are stored in this information schema even the the information about these other databases okay are also stored in this information schema table uh, database okay so now I'll use a database these are databases so I'll use this database and uh, show what are the tables inside this database so we will have to use take underscore dev okay so now the database is changed now I'm inside this detected dev to list out the inside a database you have multiple tables where you store the data so to list out the tables you do show tables so these are the tables stored I mean these are the tables which is there on detected.com so so you know that in database there are multiple tables there are relation between tables in relational database and inside the table there are multiple rows and columns so to have a look on this I'll use uh, database table so this is users table okay in users table if you see there are multiple rows I mean columns which is UID name Th these all interface are clustered because of the less space and uh, width of screen okay we have limited width of screen and the number of columns are many more okay so these are clustered so better I'll show you in some nice user interface to so we have a very nice interface for this which is called PHP my admin this is a tool which is freely available and you can integrate it with your MySQL server and data uh, web server okay so here once you go to PHP my admin it is asking for username which is my case root and the password so now see you are logged into a nice uh, interface which is clean not like previous one and here you can see the number list of databases so these are the list of databases on this server okay you can see information schema is still there okay and this is detected dev so we will go to detected dev well so these are the tables inside this database detected dev okay and we were having look on users table so let's go to users table this is uh, okay so inside users table we will see what are the structure of this so see these are the column so this is first column this is second column first column is UID 
name, password, email, and so on. So we have many, many, many more information to store. And these are these are the each record. This is for user one. This is user two, user three, and so on. Okay. So likewise, these uh, these are the method by which we store the database in our uh, the data in our database system. Okay. So this is the actually logical view which we will be studying throughout our course in form of table and rows okay but on physical level the database is stored uh, quite differently okay so that is not our concern here so logically we can see the data is stored like this we also have various uh, i mean various features in this uh, in this php my admin like you can import export and you can do uh, some kind of like uh, practice like you can uh, directly uh, practice my sql command through this interface and you also have a designer interface where these all tables and all are listed in form of nice design what we actually see in your book and also see this is a table where you have these multiple fields okay so there are many more tables that's why this is also like overlapped okay so this is uh, overall overview of a database system this is quite interesting if you want to try this you can download if you are on windows system you can download download a vamp package w a m p vamp for windows so this gives you all the package of web server mysql server and uh, the uh, backend language that is php similarly you can also use lamp on linux so i I would suggest you to try it sometime if you get some time uh, you will find it quite interesting rather than only study this in books okay so I hope you have enjoyed this see you in the next lecture thanks for watching